I'm Peter Boiter. Now here's your dilemma. You've been invited to a fantastic party. The invitation says black tie, so quite sensibly, you've gone out and bought a fantastic silk black bow tie to tie yourself. How do you do it? Well, this video is going to show you how to get it right first time. Not only that, the video shows it as though you were actually looking down on the bow tie and tying it. So it should be really easy for you. This is Mr. Clearhead. Now Mr. Clearhead's going to be our model and it's around his neck that we're going to tie the black bow tie. For the actual tying of the bow tie, we're going to put Mr. Clearhead in this position so that it actually looks like you're looking down your own neck as you tie the black bow tie. Just for this first part, I put Mr. Clearhead in an upright position so that you can actually see that the first thing you need to do is obviously button up your shirt lift both of your collars up and then hang the bow tie around your neck ensuring that nothing is twisted. Okay, so now we're looking at how you will be looking at your bow tie when you tie it. So the very first thing is looking down on the bow tie, get the left hand side of the bow tie slightly longer than the right hand side by about one and a half inches. Now, a good guide is that the point of the right hand side of the bow tie is just where the left hand side of the bow tie narrows in the center. The next stage is really simple. Put the left longer side over the right hand side as shown. Next, tuck the left hand side up behind the right hand side and pull it tight to make a simple knot in the process. This shot shows the knot formed, but it's loose. So no problem, just tighten it up nice and tight around your neck. Next, put the long side up onto your right shoulder to keep it out of the way for now. Form the front of the bow tie by forming a loop on your right and the wing tip on your left. Where the shape narrows, this shape should be right in the middle of your collar and hold it with your left finger. With your right hand, bring the piece of the bow tie that's been sitting on your right shoulder down and run it down the centre of the bow tie. This is the bit that forms the centre fixing of the finished bow tie. With your left hand, hold and pinch hold the two front parts of the bow tie you've created so far together. This creates a nice loop behind what you've already tied. With your right hand, take the last loose section and poke it partially through this loop from your right hand side, ensuring that the single right hand wing loop of the bow tie stays on your right side and is not passed through the loop. This creates the second loop on your left with a single wing on your right hand side. You're nearly there. To tighten the bow tie, just pull gently on the two looped sections only. A correctly formed bow tie will have a looped section on your front right backed up by a single wing, and your left front will have a single wing at the front with the looped section behind it. Adjust the bow tie for neatness by pulling and smoothing here and there the effect you desire. Be aware that a bow tie you've tied yourself should always look self-tied. Don't try and emulate an artificially created snap-on type. Then pull down your collar and be ready to face the crowd. Later on, when the party hots up, you can just pull on your bow tie, undo your collar and let your bow tie just hang around your neck, making you look extremely cool like Sammy Davis Jr., Dean Martin and Frank Sinatra, with the benefits of getting you instant membership to the exclusive Rat Pack Club.